Hey guys, welcome back to the video. I'm Jerry from Bigelow Woodcraft. And hey, Saker reached out to me again. Uh, they reached out with that grease coupler, that mini chainsaw, and they just reached out about this cordless buffer polisher, and they sent me this. I use a buffer and polisher. We do these lights, some car hoods, and things like that. So they reached out to me, they sent me this. Um, one of the things I really want to use this for, uh, like if you're doing Rubio Monaco on wood, this stuff, these are fantastic. But let's take a look what they sent me here. A various pads and discs. It's all Velcro. I'm not sure. Probably just another polishing rag. Big buffer. Some fine grit. 2,000 grit. Probably a few of them in there. Nope. And it's got a little battery and rechargeable. So we're going to use this today and we're going to give you... A, you guys my thoughts and opinions it's variable speed i don't know if you can see all this so we have a couple of cards to uh polish up so let's see how it does guys we'll give you a little before and after so that one's pretty hazy this light's a little better but it has some pretty big scratches in it but i don't think we'll get those out so let's see how it does though. So we got a handful of guys here, four of us here. And so you might see a few of us on and off camera. So enjoy the show. What you want on here, John? Yeah, yeah that's what we picked. I remember about everything. Yeah, see, I used to do them wet. Yeah. 3M, anything made by 3M is good. This is gonna, this should get off. Then we turn it on high speed. I think it's cleaning it right up. How's it feel, John? Did it feel pretty? It's really easy to use, I mean, for, for what it is. Yeah, it's not too heavy on your arms. No, you don't have a giant buffer you're trying to right. more control. Oh, it looks like later to me. Well, with the variable speeds with that and all the attachments with it, it'd be handy. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be really handy. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking, too. Dad could probably walk in there. Yeah, you could throw it. Right. Those Never thought of that. Ones. Washable Washing. pads. That looks really nice. This works great though. Very lightweight. 
easy maneuver. Well, you can run it with one hand like that. That's yes. what's so handy about it. You know, it's not trying to jump out of your hand. You don't have to fight with it. Honestly, the speed select's not super loose. It works just. Big time, mean? big yep. time. Yeah. Well, I mean, just think about like small spots on a car when you're painting. You have to get right. going. This yep. would be so great for those small spots, those huge ones, just, just are pain to get to. And like I said, you can maneuver it so well. The speed select works great, except it's not super loose. It's not over time. Very works very good. Well, you always feel when you're all done. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, I'd say the Saker was a win. The guys who used it really liked it. They said it was light. Uh, the, the speed control was sensitive, but not too loose, so it didn't vibrate out of speed. And where's the battery at still? It says two-thirds of a battery on it. They got a little indicator, some lights. That's full speed. So... We'll put this thing to work. Thanks for coming along, guys. Have a great day. We're going to do the Kubota, too, guys. Jim, you want a rag? <laughs> well, you're going to need a rag for your hands. Okay. I'm about ready. I have some dye for this kind of plastic. <laughs> for Jeep fenders, those fender players. Like, yeah. Yeah, I got a dye. Yeah. Oh, I worked this thing hard this last few years. Like, I'll be honest, this is a great shape. I can already see it coming to light. Oh, yeah, big time. What'd you put on this? Uh, rubbing alcohol. Oh, crack your five when you talk. It's not going to start now. Oop, I keep... Jim, check this out. This, I'm pretty impressed. After I wiped all the hazing off. It looks a whole lot better than it did. Even bought a lot of the dents out. <laughs> There's a few. No, it looks nice. Don't look bad at all. Uh -huh.